Hi everyone. Today we are going to discuss IPv4 or IP version 4 header. So uh, as we have been discussing that when a host, for example this host with having having an IP address this wants to send some information to some other host which is available on some other network then router actually this host machine actually looks at the IP address in the packet for example there is a packet like this and the network layer and in this header part there is an IP address so so by looking at the header part and within that header part there is an IP address and router makes decision that where to send that that packet so is this is the uh, packet shown here so in that packet we have the header and we have the data so in this header part we have a lot of information which is going to help the router to make make decisions and there are different fields which are helping on the network layer so this is the router actual router just just for illustration purpose and every router is going to maintain a database that's, that's called routing table and the routing table has uh, the information about all possible paths to reach some specific IP address so we are focusing our today's discussion on the header part of the packet so this is the header part of the packet so we just zoom in the header part of, of the packet and you see in this header part we have different different names so actually these all are bits so these all are bits these all fields are represented for example from this to this these all are bits and this in this header part the the the, the the pack packet header size if you go from this so before coming this i want to emphasize that from this part to this part there are 32 bits it means for if we count from this to this in between them so in from this so this single part from this to this part there are 32 bits 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 14 likewise 32 bits are there and here also this is 32 bits 32 bits 32 bits 32 bits 32 bits and 32 bits and from from here to here there are 16 bits so from this point to this point from this point and this point so this is the middle point there are 16 bits and from this point to this point there are 8 bits and this is 4 bits and this is 4 bits so this is how uh, different different length of or different number of bits are assigned to different fields for example version field has four bits length uh, field has four bits and this ds field has uh, eight bits in the same way this packet length because this is the this is the half of the 32 bits so this packet length has got 32 bit uh, to represent this packet length and this IP version 4 packet header is basically minimum is 20 bytes so if we count this one 32 32 32 bits means 4 bytes so 4 bytes because 1 byte is equal to 8 bits so 32 bits means 4, 4 bytes so 4 bytes 4 bytes 4 bytes and 4 bytes so this will be 20 bytes in length so this will be minimum uh, header size of IPv4 <coughs> but we'll we'll be discussing this th this one additional this is this is optional if this is there then of course the size of the packet will increase and if this is not there then the minimum size of the packet will remain 20 bytes now we are going to discuss the specific fields which are available in the IPv4 header so I'm, I want to again emphasize that we are discussing only this part. We are discussing this header part. <coughs> and in this uh, header part, the first, first, the most important or one of the most important field which we are going to discuss is the source IP address. So you can see this is the source IP address and the source IP address contains 32 bit binary. And this, re this represents the IP address of the sending node in this case so this if this node is going to send 
then in this part the IP address of this node will be there so in this header part so in this field of the header we have the source IP address likewise we also have the destination IP address so if the source wants to send information to this node then we also have the destination IP address so these two fields of 32 bits each are having the source IP address and the destination IP address then we have a field that is part of the header so we have a field that is indicating the version so one version FV, uh, so you see here this version is 4 bits in length and this indicates the version of the IP for example we have IPv4 and IPv6 so, so at particular instant of time which version of IP address IP is going to be used is this the IPv, IP version 4 or if this is IP version 6 so at one time only one type of version will be carried by this uh, packet so for instance I want to illustrate here this is a packet there is header part and there is a data so this data is being carried by using this IP or this IP so which IP version is being used that information is available in this part of the header or in this field of the header then we have the length field so the length field represents the maximum length of the header so the maximum length of the header is represented by 4 bits so you can see here there are 4 bits and so the minimum header length is 20 bytes but for maximum we have 4 bits so it means how many what can be the maximum size if we take 2 raised to power 4 then whatever is the answer that will be the maximum size of the packet so that should be so that should be